In this video, we will show you the commissioning process for the SolarEdge Home Backup Interface solution when installing it in a partial home backup configuration. This solution applies when adding the backup interface to an existing system using a SolarEdge Home Network Meter. Make the electrical connections to the buoy as described in the connection manuals and videos. You can find them in the description of this video. Turn on the inverter's AC feed and battery circuit breakers. Now set the inverter's P10 switch to 1. If the inverter is either not fully commissioned with the battery or updated to the latest firmware version, scan the inverter's QR code and follow the on-screen instructions. Otherwise, proceed to the next step. To power on the buoy, under the lower left corner of the unit, set the toggle switch to on. First, please remove the meter from setup. You can find a link showing this procedure in the description of this video. In setup, tap device manager. When the buoy is discovered, tap its checkbox. Then tap add selected. When all devices in the system are updated, tap continue. Now it's time to remove the buoy internal meter from setup and add the SolarEdge home network meter. Tap meter 1. Now, please remove the buoy meter from setup. Now add the inline meter. You can find a link showing this procedure in the description of this video. You should configure its function to export import. Now, change the meter Modbus ID from 2 to 3 on setup and then on the meter itself. Next, tap View status. Check that meter status is OK. Then tap Done. Go back to the commissioning screen and tap Power Control. Tap Energy Manager. Tap Energy Control. Now select your preferred energy control mode. Then tap the back arrow. Now tap Backup configuration. Make sure backup is enabled. In the Backup Reserved tab, you can set the amount of battery energy reserved for backup. Configure your preferred backup reserve. For example, setting Backup Reserved to 40% means that 40% of the battery energy is reserved for backup and the rest is available for self consumption. In case you are commissioning multiple inverters with batteries, Please note that you have to configure the backup reserve for each inverter separately. When finished, tap Done. Congratulations! The SolarEdge Home Backup System is ready for use. For more information, visit Edge Academy and our YouTube channel.